Today, I am releasing my Minecraft in VRChat world to the public. To help you get started, I will be taking you around the world and showing you all of the steps and features to get the most out of the world. This includes an explanation of the controls as well as addressing some of the most common problems that players face. Feel free to jump to any part of the video that is most relevant to you. When you first join the world, you will be greeted by the world's logo. On your right, you will see some text explaining the world and the current known bugs. On your left, you will see a gold block, which you will have to touch to start generating the world. When the world has generated, you can touch the gold block to spawn into the world and start playing. In VR, you will have access to your inventory above your left hand. There, you will have a pickaxe which you use to remove blocks, your selected block which you use to place blocks, and a chest which opens a menu to select the block you wish to place. To use your pickaxe, you can simply reach over with your right hand and grab, which will equip the pickaxe on your right hand. Then, to destroy a block, you can simply touch the block with the tip of your pickaxe. Alternatively, you can simply grab with your left hand, which will automatically equip the pickaxe in your left hand. To place a block, you can reach over with your right hand and grab the block icon. This will give you a preview of where you will be placing a block. If you are happy with the location, you can pull trigger on your controller, which will place the block. To select a different block, you can reach over with your right hand and short squeeze the chest, which will open a menu for you to select a different block type. You do this simply by pointing and pulling the trigger on the block you wish to use. In desktop mode, your inventory will be available to you at your feet. You will get the same pickaxe, block and chest as in VR. To use the pickaxe, you simply point at it and left click, which will equip the pickaxe. Then, in order to remove a block, you can simply touch it, just like in VR. To place a block, you can look at your block icon and left click it. Then, you will get a preview of where you will be placing a block. If you are happy with the location, you can simply left click again, which will place the block. Once you are done placing blocks, you can right click. To choose a different block type, you can look at your chest and left click. After doing so, you should right click, which drops the chest item, which is a limitation of the current inventory system. Then, you can simply look at one of the blocks you would like to use and left click, which will equip it. If you see this warning when joining the world, it means that there are currently too many players building in this world instance. You will not have access to your inventory or placing or removing blocks. You will have to wait until a sufficient amount of players have left before you get building permissions. This is done in order to preserve world performance. And that's all. I hope that you will enjoy the world and I can't wait to see what you will create. And on that note, I hope to see you in the next video. Bye bye.